video, while I'm waiting for my motor to come back, I've basically cleaned and painted all of my suspension parts and a lot of other pieces, the cross member, uh, to get ready for the build when I finally do get my stuff back. Uh, got new bushings, new bearings, new hardware on everything. Um, I'm also uh, showing that I built my rear box to hold my wheels so that uh, the complete box that holds both wheels together and uh, that's where I'm at right now. I got out of town for a few weeks, slowed me down. But for the last week, week or so, I've been cleaning up all of the suspension components, all of the drive gear, all of the drivetrain. Um, this is the rear cross member. Uh, that's painted to match the block of the motor, which is scheduled to come back in the next week or two. Um, transmission's being rebuilt. Here's all of uh, parts with lots of labor and scrubbing and get it all cleaned up. It's all brand new heavy duty enamel paint, uh, brand new racing bushings, uh, painted. Uh, this is uh, the one of the front knuckles. Uh, there's the hub. New, I got brand new dust covers for the uh, the hubs. And then there's the uh, there's the rear uh, carrier, uh, basically the rear spindle. And here's the rear spindle. Took a while to get the bearings out of those. Very hard. Various parts, control links. Uh, there are the lower control arms. Got the, kind of stuck the bushings in one of them there. Uh, there are the lower uh, anti-torque uh, bars. Uh, here are my axles. I just uh, got back from the axle shop. Guy rebuilt these axles for me. Brand new, new boots, new bear. Uh, New, new joints, all new bearings. Uh, I'm still going to do a little painting on those, make them look a little better. Okay, so this is the rear box. Everything's been removed. Uh, lining the box up on the floor shows that I have a, about a two and a little over two and a half inch flare on both sides. So the rear will flare about three inches on the rear. Um, it's all my parts. Putting things together. I bought this little press right over here. This little six ton press. I had to do a little modification on it but this is uh, from Harbor Freight. This did just, just, just did a wonderful wonderful job.